Hey everyone, I have here the second generation Apple Pencil for my iPad mini here. Now, I also have the, I guess the newer iPad Pencil that's USB-C version, but this is the latest one. All right, the normal Apple documentation. Here's the pencil itself. Now, here are the differences. This is the second generation pencil. It doesn't have a USB-C port here like the first generation pencil is. This is the USB-C port. The shape looks pretty similar. I think the second generation is also a little bit bigger uh, in length. So as you'll see here, it's a little bit longer than the first generation Apple Pencil. From what I know about these two is, of course, this one charges and pairs via the USB-C port on the pen itself. It does have a magnetic portion on here so that it could attach to your iPad on the side like this, but it does not charge that way. You have to charge it via the USB-C port. I think you also have to pair it the very first time with your iPad um, using this port as well. Um, from what I also understand, there is no sensitivity um, sensor on this pencil either. Um, and then there are other, several other features that are missing. This is the fully featured Apple Pencil here, the second generation one. Um, this one charges via the uh, magnetic side here. So just plugging it next to it. As you'll see, the Apple Pencil is detected. It's at 0%, so it's not charged. So the Apple Pencil is about 12% charged now. Apple Pencil here, the first generation with the USB-C port, does not have all these settings right here. Um, this one does have it. As, you'll see, as you can see here, double tap. There is a double tap portion on the pencil that can um, allow you to trigger some of these um, uh, items right here. You can switch between current tool and eraser, switch between the current tool and the last used one, show color palette, and show ink attributes. Uh, so these weren't available in this one. And this one, so as I was saying, this is the fully featured Apple Pencil. So let's give this a shot. So here's the writing feel. Feels really good. Go ahead and try the double tap. And as you can see, it automatically erases. So this is very convenient for those of us that are using this as a primarily as a writing device or a, even for artists, probably it really makes sense as well that you can just double tap and it will go into uh, the erase mode. Otherwise, you know, coming back up here and trying to hit erase just doesn't, you know, it's just extra effort. So there you have it. This is the Apple Pencil second generation, comparing it with the Apple Pencil USB Type-C version. And hopefully this helps you make your decision. Thanks for watching.